And you know, that's all I'm saying. Some of these influential figures, you know, they had involvement in, you know, gruesome, gruesome atrocities, man. And not just the people that was like, you know, it's close to me, but also like just in a body of Christianity and, you know, like intentionally and specifically, like you got people that was involved in things that were, was to undermine and sabotage my success in the past already before this generation. You feel me? So it's like when it came now, you know, you got people that's, that's from, you know, the same, I guess, you know, parts of society and they already attempted so much on my life with so many ways to destroy me any way possible. You know, with lies, slander, everything hard for absolutely, seemingly no reason. Now, when you think about some people who were from the same parts of society in the past already, you know, completed, you know what I'm saying, murders and, and things like that, you know, towards my detriment, you know, to sabotage my life. You know, it ain't no coincidence that the same, that the people like, you know, certain these certain influential figures still, you feel me, praying on my life. You know, they're saying all, making up all this stuff. People clearly see contrary to anything they said. I don't know. I don't personalize the experience with it. You feel me? I didn't really care enough too. But when people see what they're doing to my life over seven years, you feel me? It. I mean, I was never interested in personalizing the experience. It's, it's like it's a. It's like it's a way, man, to like lock me into, you know, certain cultures or traditions. You feel me? When 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 in reality, that wasn't you know what I'm saying like like I mean it's like let me see let me think you know what I'm saying it's just like cars you feel me we think about cars there's so many different cars you feel me not everybody want to be you know not everybody want every car you feel me it's some things better for other people and things like that now people who I guess sell vehicles if cars were traditions you know what I'm saying? It's different kinds of something for everybody. Everybody got their own. You know what I'm saying? So it's like not everybody's favorite gonna be everything. You feel me? Like you're not gonna not every not er, everybody's favorite vehicle not gonna be every vehicle. You feel me? It's things for different reasons that people care more about other stuff or they will prefer others over others. You feel me? So that's the kind of situation like some people force you to be stuck on certain cars it's like i'm not you know what i'm saying it's like i mean it may i can't i can't you know what i'm saying deny the fact that certain vehicles may be you know what i'm saying interesting or maybe you know let's say m compatible with certain people for different reasons that doesn't mean that they have to be putting their vehicles you know what i'm saying posters pictures of their vehicles and just bombarding me with their vehicles you know what i'm saying like just pretty much you know putting like all their interests you know what i'm saying in my life forcing it on me you know in addition with murder in addition with larceny in addition with extortion you know what i'm saying so you know that by the other things that's happening that you know the intention of whoever doing this is not good towards your life because of the damage you know, it's not a coincidence. There's already happened over the course of a long period of time. And so the same thing is still happening and possible at this moment. You know what I'm saying? That's weird. So it's like I'm being forced to acknowledge realities. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, it's like I'm being forced to hug. You feel me? Nouns that never had my best interest in mind. And it's like the human factor is that, that whoever forced you to hug, it's like they're ignoring the human factor or the humanity of the person who they force it to, I guess, you know, accept these atrocities that's happening, that's already happened, or they're ignoring that they ever happened, but they did happen, which would, you know, determine my feelings towards certain nouns, you feel me, like, I'm not comfortable with these people, you know what I'm saying, or these vehicles, you feel me, you know what I'm saying, because of things that I've gone through in my past. They're ignoring the things I've gone through at like it never happened to, and, and still allowing these same nouns or influential figures to keep, you know what I'm saying? Trying to sell me their vehicle. Think about it, man. You feel me? Like they're not acknowledging what, what I've gone through and so these people still here. It's like, I mean, anybody who, who I guess, I guess everybody got marginalizations, you feel me? I mean, 
people who never checked these people about what they were doing to serving the God, knowingly and willfully, if they knew about it, then they also was in favor of it. And depending on how large a number that is, that's going to change the nature of what society is, the fabrics, because the people is the society. You know what I'm saying? So it only can go so far without, you know what I'm saying? It only can go so far with so much being allowed. You feel me? And since since God is life, you feel me? Without God in a society, it only can go downhill. You feel me? There's no progression for it. No matter what. Because no matter what, God is the force of life and prosperity and progress and everything. It's none of that without God. It's all only thing left is Satan. You feel me? So that's the situation. It's like, I mean, I never had like issues with some of these influential figures, but they had issues with me before I even understood anything. You feel me? But I didn't understand that either. You feel me? So it's like by them still being able to do this kind of stuff to me, is it put me in a position of having to acknowledge, you know what I'm saying, the reality of these people, which which I know their intention were to lock me into, you know what I'm saying, their their reality. But that wasn't what I was all about. You feel me? I'm not all about them. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm not even fans. You feel me? But I'm being forced, you feel me, too, because actions people doing it. Then the actions don't stop. I mean, just just the other day, they just tried to destroy my platform again. You know what I'm saying? They, everybody know everything I wrote. I've blown minds within the last couple weeks, last couple months. You feel me? I've been blowing minds. And still to this day, I'm dropping new quality stuff. You know, how on earth, you know, feel me? What are they blacking out my platforms? Because these person lying on me. I'm like, okay, if you know these or these persecutors lying on me, then why are you why are they still able to keep destroying my stuff behind the lies that you know that they telling on me? Like nobody cares about God. Or no works of God. Like they all I mean, that been a pattern that been happening since I created, just like my own poetry corner. But everybody can play my stuff back, man. You feel me? If what whatever slander against me was true. Then I wouldn't be, you know, I wouldn't be as open with it. Like, no, I want everybody to see my stuff and read it. It's been visible for years. There's no reason why it wouldn't have been. You feel me? I mean, clearly, anybody who read my stuff will see otherwise. Anybody who hear my stuff see otherwise. You feel me? All they got to do is play it. That's the reason for this antagonism. Like, they, these, you got people who pay injustice and, uh, and people to destroy your life. Out of jealousy, like, and, and because of what already was, it's a continuation of the same situation that's been happening. So, all in all, it's a 23 year long hate crime, even longer than 23, maybe. Feel me? When I started writing, that didn't stop it. But they had slanders premeditated and preset for me, just in case they, they was watching to see whatever my blessing of God amounted to, and then they just dropped it on me. But they doing all this to God. Your work of God. Feel me? Or art from God. And then it continued. This whole situation was premeditated. Whoever said what, it was premeditated. They put themselves in that position. I mean, they knew what they was doing, though. The whole time. That's not my responsibility to, to incorporate. I mean, why, why they favorite artists not going through this? Feel me? Why they not having to deal with this? I'm doing the work for God. You feel me? <laughs> These the end times, man. Right?